Hi, I'm Michael Fucci and welcome to the Pacific Design Center. We are here for another electrifying evening celebrating Geneco and their 2018 annual Hollywood Gala. We're here tonight with sports stars, celebrity influencers, all coming together to support the great things that Geneco is doing. It's been a great relationship with, uh, with Geneco and with AFAM especially, and uh, um, so we're getting some stuff done, which is really great. That's wonderful. I saw pictures of the new soccer field. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so we you know, built the, uh, the soccer field um, uh, and the kids, you know, just get so much out of it, and they're thrilled about it. They're excited about it, and we're, you know, the whole school is um, is year to year just sort of improving exponentially, and um, and these students are really, you know, really gaining the benefit from that. And so, um, so that's exciting. You know, it's it's also a great thing to have a state of the art sports facility. Beautiful. You yeah. know, and. Uh, and it, and it just keeps the kids so excited about school and, you know, sort of bouncing in in the morning. And so, you know, it's all of that and that self-worth and that energy, you know, obviously all of it, as we all know, is such an important part of engaging students. So what are some of your goals for this upcoming year with your partnership with Geneco and Brightland? Well, with Brightland, you know, we're finishing up uh, the, uh, the, the secondary school building that's there and then um, we're doing the basketball courts and then We'll start introducing a lot more of a kind of drama department in the in the school as well, arts and drama department um, and, a, and a music department. And so we'll be working on the building and the, uh, um, and extending the building for all of those things. Um, so we're just going to sort of keep keep going and uh, and really, you know, the the goal is always going to be just to give these kids and the kids at the Brightland Academy just a world class education. How many students are currently enrolled? We have uh, a couple of hundred students down there, so um, and uh, what we'll want to do is to keep that growing and uh, and getting more and more people in. And also, with some of the facilities that we're having, they won't just be for uh, Brighton students, okay. but uh, for um, but you know for the wider community, for students from around. You know, we'll really try and engage a lot more of the um, of the community. It's wonderful. Now, if, if someone were to ask you, I mean, you keep coming and giving your time to Jinko. If they were to ask you, why should I volunteer with Jinko? Why should I donate to Jinko? What would you tell them? Well, I'd say it's because these kids, you know, for, for you know, obviously Jinko does a, a range of, of things, and so there's great stuff that Jinko does with with hospitals, which um, obviously is incredible and very important, uh, and that's really giving giving life to people. Um, with the school, I think that what's important is that these kids get a real chance, you know, and um, uh, and there's so much, um, there's just such an incredible amount of potential. They're so bright, you know, uh, they're so bright, so smart, so capable, and just needing the opportunity. And so that's 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 what we're going to provide them. You know? It's got to be really exciting to see the work that you're doing being able to touch just even one or two children's lives, but let alone 200, but just to see that they get a chance because of, of the work that you're doing and the work that you're doing. Yeah, I mean, it's incredibly gratifying, you know, to, to do that. And that was always part of, of the project of it, you know. Like anything, you know, it's, it's in a sense, it's a drop in the ocean, but it's it's so important to, to the individuals, you know, and that is really from individuals is where all the difference really comes in. and so. And like I say, we're going to keep on going, we're going to keep growing, and we're going to try and you know, affect as many people as we can. And with Gene Coast Up, I think we can really make a really positive impact. Well, thank you for being here tonight. Thank you for all that you do for Gene Co. And it was a pleasure speaking with you. Thank you. Jinko represents to me the, the doing as opposed to just the talking about doing. Uh, you know, our family and his family have been doing this for a long time, really on the ground work in Nigeria when it comes to hip replacements, knee replacements, underprivileged kids, education. Um, and, you know, it's, it's growing and uh, that, that is something that I am I'm very proud of them and very proud that I can be a part of it because what represented my involvement with it was uh, a few years ago the Bring Back Our Girls movement right. which became very famous and I just felt it was going to be a moment in time it would be the sort of the, 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 the hot topic for a moment and then it would go away and, and that proved to be the case and these girls who suffered and are suffering this injustice it's still going on and so 
you know, it's, I'm just very glad that we can do something about it through this uh, organization. What keeps you most engaged? What keeps me most engaged is seeing results. You know, I was in Nigeria early this year and seeing five girls who we have pulled out of their circumstances doing well, struggling in certain areas because what they've gone through is psychologically very, very um, damaging and difficult. But I know that they are better for our involvement in their lives. And so that's the thing that, that keeps me going. And then big picture, you know, what we're doing still feels like a drop in the ocean, but it's a drop more than would have been there otherwise. So, so you know, just like I say, the doing is what keeps me going. It's like a, a, a tapestry or everybody has a little part of the puzzle, putting in a, a different piece of the puzzle. And yeah, creates yeah, a... yeah, exactly. Yeah, you're either part of the solution or you're part of the problem. So, you know, I, uh, I want to be part of the solution. Can you tell us a little bit more about uh, your scholarship, your leadership scholarship for, for girls? Yeah, so it started out very much as a reaction to what was happening with the, the girls affected by Boko Haram. And now we've broadened it because, um, you know, in, in being in Nigeria, in seeing that this marginalization of girls along educational lines is pervasive across the country, not just with that particular situation. You know, we have the means and the resources to um, nurture the great young female minds of that great nation and again it's a drop in the ocean but to just be nation or nationally minded as opposed to you know state minded I think is, is, is a very natural next step for us. And you're seeing that the tangible results from the work that you're doing which is great. Now if, if someone were to ask you, I mean you keep coming back, you're donating all your time and energy uh, to supporting Geneco. If somebody were to ask you, why should I support Geneco? Why should I donate? Why should I get involved? What would you tell them? Well, you know, I, I also work with an organization called uh, uh, Girls Rising. And, you know, there are several studies that have shown the way to end world poverty is to educate girls. Pure and simple. If you if you do that, it completely changes um, the economic structure in 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 underprivileged communities. Um, it also means that the workforce expands. Um, it means that some of the cultural um, and societal mindsets get eroded because you know you have women who are in positions of leadership to help educate the next generation so um, you know anyone who wants to see the end of world poverty this is an organization through what we are doing that is one of the places um, that 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 will eventually I hope and pray we'll, we'll, we'll see those results. Well, you are seeing the results, and, and I thank you so much for being here tonight, for supporting Gene Co. as you have, and, and it's going to be a wonderful evening. Thank you. I appreciate it. Nice to speak to you. Good to see you.